all right guys welcome back to another beautiful day in my backyard april um today uh we're doing some feeding um because the rain has subsided as a, a little so it gives me an opportunity to get some feed out to the um apiary so let's get the episode started All right guys, so the formula is already mixed up for the bees. So it's just for me to put them on the colony. And um, if you want to know how this was made, I do have another video where I break down how I make the sugar mix um, for the bees, which is a one-to-one -one ratio. Um, one part sugar, one part water. So links, you will see that in the video there. And um, you can check it out if you want to know how to make this to feed your bees. Alright, so there you have it guys, um, just pretty much put the sugar feed on the hive and um, look here, let's take a look. See, this is the thing, see this is the thing, I must say that I really do enjoy feeding um, the yard because it's one of the most, the more easier chore to do. And as you can see, everyone is pretty pretty calm and just getting back to work. It's almost as if no one really entered the yard. So I really do enjoy doing feeding. It's um, a lot easier. And then after I do my feeding for the bees, the next thing that I move on to is my fishes. Now, um, I don't know if you guys would have remembered that I um, installed some fish into the apiary with the water lily on top and pretty much the water lily serves as a surface for the bees to land and, and get the water and then take it back to their hives but in order to ensure that no mosquitoes um, get into this water I install some freshwater fish And as you can see, they have been in there for months now and they're doing pretty okay. What I feed them with though are um, mosquito larvae, which all you need is an open container with water and some organic matter in there, so like leaves. And um, pretty much hide it under the shrubs so the bees don't get to it, but the mosquitoes can and they go in they lay in it and i have free feed for the bees so i want to give them like probably three four days or five days depending just to allow them to mature and then once they get to that point 
then I pretty much take them and put them into the water and allow them the, the, the thing there to go ahead and take it out um, so yeah alright guys so that's it for today's episode um, just doing a little chore in the morning getting some feed out to the bees before I start preparing to do other stuff for the day so again um, thanks for watching if you like what I'm doing please share like comment and give us a subscribe we'd greatly appreciate it bye guys keep safe